hi to Chaco. Yes, it is beautiful. Okay, this is semifinals. We have Sheik here in the blue. He's in dead. He goes death knight. He goes ghouls in red. Of course, we have Foggy. He goes in for a warden, guys. You guys love warden, don't you? And there's a, an archer as well. An archer and a warden. Uh, but what's the ghoul doing here? This ghoul was not super early. Like we uh, sometimes see. We see super early ghoul. And then you don't have enough lumber for this cigarette. So you build a second necropolis. Not the case this game. This ghoul was a bit later. So the Ancient of War already up of course. The archer is over there. This ghoul going for a, a wisp. The warden. Oh, the warden wants the ghoul. The ghoul doesn't want to die. So he's running. He's running for his life. But let's see how far he can get guys. Let's see how far he can run. He's running. He doesn't, and he gets Shadowstruck again, which is beautiful, but it doesn't mean he's dead. 26 hit points, 16 hit points, 6 hit points, oh, he wants to kill himself and he kills himself, I assume. He killed himself, yeah, he kills himself, he didn't just uh, <laughs> die at the last moment from the poison. Uh, the Warden gets his kill as well, gets an item, Death Knight still 0 XP, he wants the, the Wisp of course, he has a, no coils, he has the Aura first. So, can he get this wisp? This wisp is very low on hit points. Does he go in the gold mine? Yes, he gets in the gold mine. The player's forces are under attack. We have a skeleton here as well. Skeleton going for the archer. The death knight going for the, the wisps here in the trees. And the wisp survives. All the wisp survives. The death knight still has zero XP. There's another archer. Hello, and here come the skeletons. Meanwhile, we have a wisp in a tree over here. Tag to tier two. Only five ghouls. He's building more ghouls, but he only has five at the moment. And he's going for this wisp, you know, with a skeleton. But beautiful wisp micro here. Puts all the hurt wisps into the haunted gold mine. The skeleton is working on the wisp. But the wisp is uh, running for his life. The death knight, he wants a wisp. The moon juice saves the wisp. Level two warden. I guess he killed the skeleton, this one. So, uh, yeah, this is level two now. Here goes another skeleton. The ghouls here creeping this creep camp in the meantime. A close of haste will, uh, is dropped there. You can pick up later. Quack is what the frog says. And you know, the skeleton attack has been defended. Three archers now approach his ancient of war. Does he have a second one anywhere? No. Solo ancient of war. Pretty rare to see that. And the death knight. He picks up the gloss but does not pick up the tome. Or does he pick up the tome? He picks up the tome guys. So so exciting to see a dead player actually pick up the tome. These ghouls here going for the wisp. Meanwhile, over here, these ghouls gonna cut down some trees. Graveyard is going up. Okay, and oh, one ghoul goes down. There is the warden with three archers killing ghouls, hunting them down, and a berserker now as well. And the forest shadow priest who dispels an archer and heals the archer, uh, dispels of skeleton and heals the archer a little bit. Death Knight just needs 12 more XP for level two. He will finally get his coils. He can finally save his ghouls. Although, you know, he only lost one ghoul so far. Uh, this archer just... Oh, nice. I mean, or nice. He, he detonates or he dispels the skeleton. He's gone, guys. The skeleton is gone. Hunter's Hole is going up. Tree of Life is going to be a Tree of Ages pretty soon. So nice right-clicking here on the Death Knight. The Warden wants this ghoul. Does she want the ghoul? Does she want it badly? No. She doesn't want it that badly. Here comes the Death Knight with two ghouls. Not much he can do here. This Ancient of War is on its way. There's the Ancient of Lore. There's another Ancient of Lore, guys. There go two skeletons. Death Knight attacks the Berserker in the face. This ghoul takes a bit of damage from the Shadow Strike. This Archer is doing just fine for now. Okay. The Warden. Doesn't that matter for another Shadow Strike? Death Knight, come on, 12 more XP. Can you not creep this or something with a few ghouls? A few ghouls? I guess I guess not. Because else you would do it, right? 12 XP for some coils. Uh, where's the first Shadow Priest? Oh, there he is. There's a stack guy. There is a Ancient of Wonders being built here. Death Knight just so annoying.
And we see the warden here going for a rogue wizard. This rogue wizard going down. Mantle of intelligence, pretty good item here for the warden. She's uh, most of her damage output is from her spells, so you really just want a lot of mana, and then you can cast a lot of spells. That's just uh, so nice. Instead of things like claws of attack, they don't help that much. The warden doesn't really attack that often. I mean, she still attacks quite a lot, but not like a warden, uh, not like a demon hunter. She doesn't attack as fast either. Well, she's gonna creep here. Meanwhile, over here, we have the Death Knight and the Lich. Death Knight is finally level 2. Lich is, uh, you know, level 1. Get some slippers. Sure. Statue is being built. Sure. He's going to Black Citadel. Sure. Sure. What a game, guys. I'm out of water. So after this game, I definitely need to get some more water. Water is so good, guys. This no overseer is uh, taking a lot of damage. Nice coil here on this ghoul. No overseer. Is he going to die here? Yeah. One of mana stealing on the lich. He gives it to the death knight. Now the death knight can steal mana. And meanwhile over here. The one of mana stealing is pretty good against a warden. Right? Because usually it's just solo warden. It's just one hero. And the mana on this one hero. On this one warden. is just so impactful. So if you can steal it. Pretty good. Get some boost of speed here. What's this Berserker going to do? He's gonna aggro the creeps. While he's still uh, while he's finishing off the creep. Why does he kill the bunny? Hello! The bunny did not do nothing wrong. We're now almost level 4. Tree of life is going up. The Berserker aggroes the creeps. And the Ancient of War is in place. This tree is going up beautifully. There's a bear. And a dead bear is getting masters. Player's forces, are under Player's forces are under attack. The Death Knight now finally level 3. The Lich is level 2. Is it time for the orb? Of course, hello. Of course it's time for the orb. We also see destroyers. Very nice. Does he go in Naga 3rd? Dark Ranger? Maybe a new hero? Maybe an Alchemist? Or a uh, Fire Lord? I wouldn't be surprised. But I would be a little bit surprised. It seems like in these European uh, tournaments here in 1.29 we see mostly just standard heroes so far. Skeleton's dying. The Warden here. She's level 4.6 or so. Has an Info Potion now. Greater Healing Potion. It is the Dark Ranger. Okay. With the Dark Rangers, you can just silence the Warden. Even if it's just like for just two seconds. You can call your Nova and maybe kill her. Of course, you can't silence her for long with these Dryads to just dispel the silence. And you cannot silence the Dryads. But we have this beautiful attack here. While Moonwall is taking so much damage. It's going down fast. We see the Moonwall upgrade here, by the way, for Foggy. Um, which means that the moonwalls have 425 mana per moonwall and they regenerate mana a bit faster at night. This moonwall, is it going down, guys? Is it going down? It does go down. And here's the warden. She's level 5 now, of course, with a bandit of energy as well. She sold the bandit of intelligence. Uh, the bear gets surrounded by the ghouls. Do we have destroyers? No, not yet. Fiends, they try to. Oh, they kill a dry. Nice coil there on this fiend. Uh, Nova on this bear. Oh, there's a fan of dice, but the healing scroll saves all the units for now. Of uh, Sheik. He does have more healing scrolls though. So the next fan of knives is going to do so much damage. These ghouls there. You can see them fall so fast. And that's there's a lot of dead ghouls. And this bear takes a coil. Is he dead? He is dead. There's no more bears. It's uh, just archers. Yeah. Just archers and trolls and dryads. Just you know one of each almost. There's a, a dust. And there's a coil. I don't think it was Warden with the dust. But Death Knight used the dust. So this fiend is going to be just fine. There's a coil on the Dark Ranger. Silence on the Warden, but she has a great healing potion. She's going to be just fine. She uses that healing potion. There goes uh, Nova. Kills two units. The Archer and the Trill Berserker. Look at the supplies. Let's see. 36 against 33. Okay, 39 now against 33. The Warden. Shadow Strike. That's level 2 Shadow Strike. So level 2 Shadow Strike. Level 3 Fan of Knives. This tree is not even up in mining yet. Oh, can he do some damage here? There's no goblin laboratory in the neighborhood. There's one all the way over there. But that's not close by or over there. What's this, by the way? Okay. An, um, a building. Okay, let me thank you after the game. Or actually, do we have some time right now? Yeah. Um, maybe. 
the warden is just standing there. Thank you for the subscription, 11 core. Uh, welcome to Chaco Bell, and thank you for your beautiful support. It's so beautiful. The Taco Flavor Kisses, though, I will give those after the the game. Nice fan of knives here. She shadow strikes the Death Knight as well. This Death Knight is running for his life. This fiend is underground. The bears here going for the next fiend. This fiend burrows the Death Knight. Oh, he takes another sh shadow strike. He coils just before he dies, but he is dead now. And the Warden is level 5. She might be silenced, but he just dispels the silence. She's going for the next Dark Ranger. After the Dark Ranger, of course, the Lich is next. I, what a mistake not having a TP there by Sheik. I, I didn't even check. I kind of just assumed he had one. There's an Abomination. The Death Knight has been re-summoned, but there's no, uh, no mana for, you know, Coil or anything. He gives the Orb to the Death Knight just before the uh, Lich dies. Sheik with a GG, guys. A GG. We're seeing a death note here by Sheik. And what else do we see by Sheik? We see ghouls. Okay, we see ghouls. We see death knights. Nice start. Do we see a warden? Of course, I'm going to check this in a moment. Do we see the warden? Or do we see a demon hunter? We see a demon hunter this game. There is a lightning shield on this archer. She's using the lightning shield against the renegade wizard, against the rogue, against the rogue. So much damage you're done with the lightning shield, of course. Very nice to creep in here by Foggy. Who's the archer away so he doesn't get any. Okay, well, the lightning shield killed the level 5. So this death knight, demon hunter, only 96 XP. How nice. Yeah, he does kill the rogue, so he now is 144 XP. But he should be level 2 at this point. So, here is a Death Knight. He has 0 XP. Dark Weaver at the. Uh, he got some nice items though. Claws of Deck. Actually, not the best item in this matchup, but it's good early game, so that's fine. Especially in combination with the uh, Sabers of Agility, which increases his attack speed a little bit. And of course his uh, his damage as well by three. Here come the ghouls, the death knight and a few ghouls. Four ghouls and skeleton going running into his base. Uh, you know, at this point, does it really matter that Demon Hunter is still level one? It matters a little bit, yeah. Level two Demon Hunter would have been a bit better. Not with the evasion, but with the... Uh... Wait, uh, did he go evasion first? No, right? No. Uh, but with the... Uh, just a bit of boost of stats. This ghoul survives. He's going for this ghoul now. This ghoul also surviving. This demon Death Knight really wants his archer. He does have dust. Will he get the archer? Maybe. He already got 25 XP. This one one wisp. Uh, the ghoul goes down there though. So there's 40 XP here for Dark Weaver, who's now at 196 XP. There goes the archer. She dies to the creep, so no XP given. And nice block here by the Death Knight. And he has three more ghouls incoming, guys. There's, that wasn't it. I mean, that was it, but there's more. There's more. The boots brought by the Death Knight, interesting. The Demon Hunter has the staff now. Is he going to staff to... Oh, he's staffing to this Wisp. To kill this uh, ghoul. The Wisp, maybe we... I mean, the Wisp tries to block. Yeah, this ghoul's dead. No, yeah, I mean... Is it a cold tower? No. There's no cold tower whatsoever. But this ghoul should be safe, right? Oh, no, he's not safe. The Demon Hunter can just walk through. And he kills the ghoul. He's level 2, of course. He's uh, He has 276 XP now. Killed in total, he killed how many? He was 144. He wasn't more, right? He was at, uh, I think he killed like two ghouls or three ghouls in total. Three ghouls, I think. Anyway, this uh, this death knight and the ghouls here, or maybe only two ghouls. I feel like only two ghouls. Or did he kill three ghouls? Doesn't matter, Chaco. Focus on these archers. With three archers here, he's building more archers. There's a hunter's hall going up. And this ghoul takes a lot of damage. Can he save it? No, doesn't have coil. There goes another ghoul. And this death knight, 50 XP only. So two wisps. And if he loses this ghoul as well, he definitely lost way too many ghouls from how little damage he did. There goes another ghoul. I like five or six ghouls, guys, for like two wisps. Three wisps. Okay, I'm sorry. Three wisps. Are under attack. And what's happening over here? This ghoul is doing just fine. We have a wisp over there, of course. We have a graveyard going up. Nice game so far, you know. You know, nice game. 
More like a ghoul hunter. <laughs> Sheep. Oh, what's happening over here? This archer is dying. She's taking so much damage. She's still alive. This archer also retreating. We have five archers here. There's a staff to war to the moon wall. Me over here. Graveyard is going up. Is he, uh, what else is he doing? No second hero. Oh, there's attack to Black Citadel. Steam Hunter. Beautiful fight with the Death Knight. Now they both have the boots. The Dark Weaver also bought the boots. And but Lord Knight Sorrow doesn't take the fight. Does retreat. Very smart. There's a panda. Of course, a panda gonna creep to level 3 very fast. There's a Lich, there's some more ghouls. I mean, this Death Knight being so low on XP. So bad for Sheik here. I don't, I don't know how he's gonna win this game, guys. I don't know how Sheik is gonna win this game. The Panda here picks up some items. I know how Foggy's gonna win this game, but what about Sheik? Death Knight walks so fast. With the boots, with the aura. Panda is almost level 2. Demon Hunter. I mean, he could creep even a little, little bit with the Demon Hunter and be level 3 in a moment. The worry Chaco Six is not gonna win. <laughs> Who's the other finalist? The winner between Death Note and Hawk. Slaughterhouse is going up. We have another Lich here. There's a Lich. Death Knight here, creeping over here. He wants a nice item. Cloak of Shadows, not that nice. Tome of Agility, not that nice. Meanwhile over here, Demon Hunter just creeping to level 3. And let's see if he's then gonna mana burn and rest some more with this Demon Hunter. Tome of IQ, that's nice. Potion of Greater Healing, sure, why not. It's a really good item in this type of situation where you're so far ahead. The only only way to lose here for Foggy, realistically, is if he loses that Demon Hunter, right? If he loses his heroes. But if you have a potion of greater healing, you're not gonna lose your heroes. So Foggy's super duper far ahead. There's level 2 mana born on that Lich. And I'll, I imagine we'll see more mana burns here. There's one on the Death Knight. Meanwhile, over here we see. Black Citadel is about to be done. Oh, the Panda comes and joins his uh, Demon Hunter. He takes a coil to the face, but there's a Mana Burn on the Lich. He's just gonna stay, use the Greater Healing Potion, just try to end the game. Early, I guess, kill the Lich, sure, why not? The Lich has boots though. Lich is moving so fast. 50 Mana Mana Burn is not really enough damage. He's going for the Death Knight now. Death Knight has an Info Potion. What's the Panda doing here? His Panda's finishing the creep. He doesn't have a Staff. Since he already used a great healing potion, he has to be a little bit careful, although he has a DP still. He buys a healing scroll. His expansion totally going up. Master Riots for now. No bears yet, and we know Master Riots can, you know, can lose you the game. Probably not in this case though, because his heroes are just so much stronger here than the heroes of Sheik. She gets level 2 death knight with like barely level 2. 206 XP. This Lich, level 1. 64 XP. She gets 3 heroes. No, only 2 heroes. What item did he just get? He got a Claws of Attack. Pretty good for the Lich. Hello Demon Hunter. There's level 1 coil on your face. There's 27 mana burn on the death knight. The panda just plays down the sentry ward so he can see. What does he see? He sees a lot. Slaughter, um, what do you call this? Upgrade. Ghoul Frenzy is being upgraded. The Death Knight takes so much damage. Can, we, can he save the Death Knight? No. The Death Knight, I mean, yes. Uh, can't save the Death Knight. We have some ghouls here in the back. I count five ghouls in the back. This Murloc Nightcrawler is totally dead, guys. Fuck, is just gonna creep this. Is he going for bears? Not yet. Not yet, guys. Overlay says she is oh stupid panda. Why doesn't they give the panda to uh... No what's it? what's wrong here? Foggy should have the panda, right? Yeah. 
Why does it give the panda to the night elf? It should go automatic, right? The panda is definitely never an undead hero in this matchup. Well, here's a nice attack by Foggy on the man. He uses the Sappers even. To kill two uh, Ziggurats. Breath of Fire. These peasants dying so fast. GG. GG, guys. GG. Foggy wins 2-0. to zero.